here now, you know, I'm going to learn a bunch of things here and, you know, whenever they feel like I'm ready, they'll call me. So, you know, it's kind of kind of just being here, being in the moment and, you know, taking it day by day. Softly to left center. There it is, Riley Green's Major League debut, a success with a single to left center. Welcome to the POD Sports Zone, where we're talking baseball. Namely, Riley Green was drafted fifth overall by the Detroit Tigers in the 2019 MLB draft. In 2021, he played 84 games with the Tigers AA affiliate, the Airy Sea Wolves, before being promoted to the AAA club, Toledo Mudhens, for the remaining 40 games. During this time, he recorded 485 at-bats, produced 95 runs, hit 24 long balls, while adding 84 RBI and 16 stolen bases. His impressive performance and the Tigers' need for a center fielder made it, well, an obvious decision to call Riley up to the big leagues. We're certainly excited um, to have him debut at home, to have him be here. Um, obviously, it was uh, kind of a matter of days until he was going to be called up, so it lines up. Unfortunately, we lose Austin in the process, but uh, what a journey for Riley to get to get the call. Tigers manager, A.J. Hinch. Not only can Riley Green swing the bat, he can flash the leather too. Multiple pundits refer to Riley Green possibly being just like him. No, not him, not you, Galloway, not you, him. Now, not all Tiger fans will agree with that assessment, not even Karen. Most athletes are known for, well, either stealing, fielding, or hitting. 
but Mr. Baseball, he could do it all. I think comparing Riley Green to Al Kaline at this early in his career could very well prove to be detrimental to the young guy's growth. That's a whole lot of pressure to put on him. I still consider him to be a rookie, not having played a full season in the bigs in 2022. Riley Green in 2022 finally gets the call up after playing 69 games with the Toledo Mud Hens in AAA ball. Now it has taken him some time to adjust to the major leagues, but it had shown some promise in 2022. He played in 93 of 162 games. Green produced 45 runs, 95 hits, five home runs, and 42 RBI. Hit for an average of 253 in the field. He displayed exceptional skill and a high baseball IQ. His young age of 22 only adds to the excitement of his potential. 2023 expectations for Riley Green. As the 2023 regular season approaches, expectations are high for Green's first full season as a pro. With the potential he has shown, the Tigers are confident in his ability to lead as a center fielder for well, years to come. While it may take some time for him to improve his game, a solid improvement from 2022 would look like a batting average over 300, hitting 15 to 20 long balls and driving in 85 runs. This spring training, Green has only had a handful of at-bats, but he is expected to be a key player for the young and developing team this season. While wins may not come immediately, watching this team develop and form chemistry on the diamond will be an exciting experience for all of us Detroit Tiger fans. Where do you see the Tigers finishing in the AL Central Division? Leave your thoughts in the comments section. And thank you for watching another edition of the POD Sports Zone. Fly ball center field. Taylor going back. Still going back. That ball's out of here.